Okay, hey Virgos. I know I haven't been here in a minute, but I'm here. Um, I was doing personal stuff. Everything is going to be in the description. We're just going to get in y'all business a little bit. Y'all know I just like to start. So, um, I'm just going to do a main spread. Whatever come out of the main spread, if it's like love, I'll do a side spread for money. If money comes out in the main spread, I'm going to do a side spread for love. And so on or so forth or however, whatever. <laughs> How to go. It's late. I'm sleepy y'all, but I'm trying to finish all of them so I can post these tomorrow. So if I be yawning, I'm tired. Um, I feel like you might not be feeling too good about a situation or whatever. Like it's not going good, or it's not working out for you, or just needed to just get over something or whatever. And you're having a hard time getting over from something, letting something go, walking away from something, even if you Say, you know, like physically I have or I'm not physically dealing with somebody like energetically, emotionally, mentally, something still got you in the chokehold. I feel like you're doing your best to block something out. It could be the situation. It could be a person. It could be whatever's going on. You don't want to think about it. You don't want to deal with it. You just want to be done with it or whatever. But it's just so hard for you. It's so, so hard for you for some reason. I feel like you're um still wanting a connection with somebody or still wanting to deal with somebody or wanting things to uh just get on the right track, get on the right page, or just go good. I just want to feel good about this connection or feel good about this person. And it's just like, this person is making it so hard. This person is making it so hard. Um, I do feel like, you know... Your person or whatever's going on in the situation has some type of plan to fix things or to come back around or do something when it comes to your connection. Or this could be you coming up with some type of plan to make something happen or do something when it comes to this situation. I feel like somebody will be surprised about um, what what your person do or your person will be surprised about what you do. Something is going to um, just be surprising because I feel like... Um, it may be out of the norm for some of you guys, or it will be um, just out of nowhere. I feel like in the past, things were going a lot better or getting good, or you felt like things were getting right or getting on track when it comes to this situation or whatever. Like, I'm feeling good about things. Things look like, you know, I'm getting what I'm putting in, or it's just like looking like it's, it's about to be good, about to go good. I feel like needing to make some type of decision. Or whatever. It could be what you want to do, how you're going to do things, if you're going to move forward from this or if you're going to work on this or whatever. I feel like you have a big decision ahead of you. And a lot of you guys are going to work on this or whatever. A lot of you people um, having a hard time walking away from this or are going to still want to try to work on this. And even if you do like walk away from it or leave it alone, I still feel like still wanting to work on this, still trying to come back, wanting to come back, still working on it or whatever. For some of you, it just will not work for you anymore. That's just the fact. It's not going to work anymore or whatever. And you're going to have a hard time trying to keep working on it or maintain it. And it's just falling apart and causing you to fall apart or falling th things to just, you know, not work out right for you. For some people, it's not going to work out. But for others, I feel like um, making a decision to work on this or whatever. And it does work out or whatever. But I feel like many of you will just walk away from a past situation and that would be the best thing that you could do. That's going to work out better than anything else trying to work on something old. For others of you, I feel like you may have just let something go or whatever or left something alone and things get better from there. Or you meet a better person or something that's a better fit or a better match for you. In the near future, I feel like you may have some issues with somebody. You may have some trouble with somebody. It could be... Um, a ex of a ex of somebody that you're seeing or just somebody in the mix of your situation that you will not like at all or will not be good at all. You just need to make sure you're thinking before you make a move, before you say something, before you act on something or whatever, or before you do something out of character or whatever. It's okay to have your guards up or expect something, but don't let it get you out of character. Um, and be okay with walking away from something. Drama, problems, whatever comes from something. If it's not... For you, if you don't want it, if it does not make you feel good, walk away from something. That That's the best way that you will be able to handle a situation. I feel things getting on track or aligning in other areas of your life. So, um, 
don't let something be a blockage for you that's not a good fit for you or you you're already seeing that it's not for you or whatever something may make you feel good in any way whatever way it is but that does not mean that it's for you and i do feel like you need to have some time and some space by yourself to work on your money work on your finances or whatever if you met somebody you're in a good space with them of course this is not for you this is for people who have not let go of a situation that's not for them or whatever if you are in a situation and you're happy i don't i'm not going to say that you need to be alone but i do feel like your focus needs to be more on your money right now more on your stability more on just being in a comfortable space when it comes to finances and work should be the, the main thing. But I feel like, you know, things working out and coming together for you, especially if you walk away from a connection and be able to heal and find what's for you. That's pretty much what I got for that part. I'm going to do the money part. Now, I do feel like some type of conflict when it comes to money. If you're already having or experiencing some type of conflict from with money, things are about to, you know, work itself out. Or whatever it's gonna be okay if you um are just you know working on your money and trying to get things right with your finances i feel like things getting on track or whatever but you know you're needing to put that focus and energy into your money into your finances right now because that's where it needs to be at or whatever i do feel like um some people needed to get another job you may have already gotten another job congratulations or just need to pick up a, another um a hustle or something or whatever because I feel like you're going to have to put your money into something that's going to drain you or you're just going to have a hard time rebuilding your money and your finances because, you know, you're having a lot of obstacles or things in the way or things that you have to handle and take care of. It's just going to be hard to just, you know, keep your money at a stable pace right now or a good place or whatever. You may have lost a source of income or some type of finances and, um, it's like you want to feel it right now. So you need to be focusing on your money and get it right. But that's what I have for Virgos.